Cobblesock, first of all, congratulations on the wonderful innings yesterday. Um, they were pretty tough conditions, Tom. Have you ever batted in anything like that before? Um, probably not. Uh, no, not quite. I mean, uh, fortunate enough to spend a few winters in Durban um, in, in previous years and Sri Lanka and stuff. So it's pretty hot and humid. Um, but yesterday was, um, yeah, pretty testing. <laughs> How difficult was it to keep concentrating in that type of heat? Um, yeah, not going to lie. It was, it, it was at times, I think. It, but like most things batting I think just went in phases really some obviously after drinks breaks or after lunch and things like that we just had a bit more time to recuperate um, and then obviously as the longer you batted just trying to keep to routines and, and things like that. And is there a feeling as well in that situation when you can see the fielding side of maybe flagging a little you think well if, if I can keep going here there's more runs? Yeah definitely I think it's, it's just a case of um, trying to trying to do the basics well um, not trying to get too fancy with anything and um, yeah making sure he's spend a, a bit of time in between balls to catch your breath after a few twos and things like that yeah and how special is it tom 100 here at lords was that was that on your mind uh, no it wasn't on my mind at the start of the day um but obviously to to kind of to do that um yeah it was just a fantastic moment really yeah i'll cherish for a very long time when you're closing in they, they talk about the nervous 90s did it feel like that um no, that's probably where the heat came in and helped, actually. I think it was just trying to, too busy trying to wipe the sweat off my eyes and, um, yeah, keep the gloves dry, things like that. So, no, not quite. Wonderful moment. Were any of your family or friends here to witness that, Tom? Yeah, my older brother was, um, was here and, my, and my, uh, my other half as well. So, no, it was a very um, special moment, yeah. Um, and a terrific partnership with Chetishwa Pajara. I just wonder what role he played in the partnership as well, Tom. Yeah, like, like we see, he's just a real calming influence. Um, not only in the dressing room when you're out there batting, um, he obviously more than knows his stuff. And um, like, he was just, he's been a pleasure to bat with. Um, fortunate to have a few partnerships with him this year and um, long way it continue. It seems to have been a terrific move, 300 since you've come to, uh, to Sussex. You must be absolutely thrilled with the way things are going. Yeah, no, I mean, honestly, I can only just say it's a reflection of um, kind of how the, the club and coaching staff and, and, and the squad of players have um, been with me, really. It's just been fantastic from, from day one, and it's just nice to be able to obviously uh, contribute. Uh, let's talk about the game because Middlesex made a good start in reply. Well, you, you saw a lot of the wicket. What, what have you made of it tonight? Yeah, I think it's uh, it's a tough one. I think when the ball gets a bit softer, um, I think it's it's a it's a pitch that takes a bit out of the ball. So um, you know when when it, when it loses its hardness and, and shine, it becomes difficult testing conditions for bowlers. Um, but but like we saw today when they bowled it, there's there's still enough there. I think you've got to just. Be really disciplined and patient, put it in the right area for, for a long time and then and, and take chances when they come.